Hey, it's Dave. How you doing? Uh, had some health issues in the family, um, so haven't really done a lot of things lately. Obviously, it's a bad hair day. It's a bad hair life, actually. So, it is what it is. Hope everyone is doing well. Hope your health is well. I feel great myself. Played football for the last game of the year on Sunday. Had a good game. Felt good to run around. I'm going to do something tonight that I haven't done enough of, and I should probably do it every time I buy a new bottle. But um, So there is a, well, something that I've just started to see online in some of the videos. Jim Beam, Jim Beam, and I haven't even had anything to drink. Jim Beam, black, seven year. This is normally a $21 bottle. I got it for $18.99. It's $21.99 normally. And it says, Bellow Notes, a smooth... Golden caramel, rich oak, and vanilla. Um, after seven years resting in barrels, something special happens. It turns into gold. No, that's not it. The liquid turns into a rich gold. Well, it does. How about that? What the hell? I, I didn't even know. <laughs> the, the liquid turns into a rich gold with notes of caramel, vanilla, and warm oak. This is the smooth aged whiskey of Jim Beam Black. Now, a lot of people. You know, Jim B may be one of the regular, the original may be one of their first whiskeys, and it's one of my first. It's okay. It's nothing special. It's very cheap. Uh, this is, uh, I've been watching a bunch of blind taste tests online, and this bottle has been beating some really expensive bottles. Uh, I just saw it take second place to a $70 bottle called Baker's. So, um, it's supposed to be great, and I haven't tried it yet. This is very exciting for me and for you. I mean, isn't it? Probably more exciting for me. So I did open it a little bit earlier and let it rest for a little bit. And here we go. This is really exciting. I don't... I kind of like stuff like this. I should, Like I said, I should probably do it more often. Uh, I did not throw the proof at you. I believe this is 90 proof. It's 90 proof, which is 45% alcohol. Nice color. Well, sitting in a barrel for seven, seven years, you know, that's gonna. One of these days I'm gonna learn how to do this better. I see a lot of guys going like this. I can't control it. Maybe I should start with my right hand. Oh, that's even worse. I am a lefty when it comes to sports. I am a righty when it comes to like eating and uh, writing. I write right handed. So. Uh, there's viscosity on on it, and well, let's see what the uh, the, the nose is. Ooh, that's nice. Yeah, you definitely smell some vanilla and oak and a little bit of caramel. Is that what it says on the bottle? Golden caramel, not just caramel, but golden caramel. I don't know the difference between caramel and golden caramel. A little bit of sweetness. Um, Damn, you know, <clears throat> I recently have bought some bottles on sale, like Makers 46, which I'll be doing later. It's normally like 39 bucks, and I got that for 28. Um, uh, Knob Creek 9, which I really love, which is another Jim Beam product. Um, uh, that was uh, normally about 38.99, and it was 24.99 at Benny's. I didn't even go there to buy it. I went there to buy Four Roses, uh, a small batch, and um, uh, it was on sale. And I'm like, I, I, you know, I've heard so much about the makers. I mean, about the Knob Creek Nine. I, I got to do it. So, well, here we go. Oh, that's nice. Oh my God. That has. It's got a like a, to me, a little bit lighter, not as heavy. Uh, Knob Creek uh, feel to it. Uh, Knob Creek, to me, has got a little bit of a heavy licorice taste, which I don't like black licorice, but it tastes great in the bourbon. But this is really easy. I mean, wow. There's like almost no burn to that at all. You know, a little bit at the end, a little bit in the finish. Wow, it is. <clears throat> this is really good. Uh, if you are looking for something that's a beginner that 
<clears throat> first of all, it's a seven, age seven years. You're not going to find too much age seven years. That's between, that's even $22. You're not going to find it. You're just not. That, that's good like this and you know a lot of people don't like Jim Beam because I, like I said I've had Jim Beam and it's a little harsh and I just don't it's it's, it's okay it was a good first starter I used to sip it at night um, but this is this is fantastic I mean I would I drink this anytime anywhere uh, just really great one of these times I'll do a blind tasting and see which of the recent ones that I've bought, which I, I mean, the Makers, the Four Roses Small Batch, uh, the Makers 46, uh, Four Roses Small Batch, and the Wood Creek 9 are fantastic. And my, you know, I'm a beginner, but they're three of my favorites that I've tried, for sure. I do like Wild Turkey, it was good. But I would take those three, and, over that and definitely take the beam uh, over Wild Turkey 101. Uh, the Wild Turkey 101 is just a real strong rough flavor but it's really good man. It's really good. Uh, <clears throat> so yeah, thumbs up. This is uh, this is solid. Uh, I'm so glad I got this. It's fantastic. So if you like this video please hit the subscribe button. Uh, if you got any questions, hit me with questions. Um, hug your loved ones. Uh, life is short. Normal is a great thing. And uh, right now I'm not going through some normal stuff in my family, but we're a strong family. We love each other. We laugh. So laugh. Laughter is the greatest thing in the world. Um, and, uh, you know, find something that gives you a little bit of passion. Uh, football for me used to be softball. One of these days I'd like to go back to playing softball. I know I'm 63, going to be 64 in ooh, a month and a half. Yikes. Um, hey, I'll be on Medic Medicare soon. Isn't that exciting? Social Security. That extra money coming in is going to be pretty nice. But anyways, uh, White Sox suck. They're going to try to blow another one tonight. Maldonado's playing. This stuff is great. Jim Beam. Black, aged seven years. I'm going to throw the bottle up one more time. Um, as good as and better than some more expensive bottles. So can't go wrong with it. It's fantastic. Give it a shot. This is Dave. If you like this, please subscribe. Uh, click the uh, thumbs up like button. Comment if you'd like. Or just tell me to go piss off. That's fine too. I, can, I don't get mad. I get even. So this is Dave Toodles. Have a good one. Bears.